This is just for This is just for me. Thank you for calling support. My name is David. How can I help you? Oh, hey David. Um, I have a um, this uh, pop up message that's telling me that I should call this number. Oh, uh, sure. Do you have any error message on on that number? Is there any error message you are getting on your computer? Um, it says I should. Um, and there's like just warnings. On there, it's like there might be a potential threat. Yes, you need to hold the Windows logo key and later on. Yeah, that's what the potential threat. Can you please read that entire message for me? Your computer may be infected by malicious adware or spyware, and it should call the call the phone number immediately for assistance. Okay. So I would like to ask you one thing: that have you made any kind of security changes in your computer recently? Um, I don't, I don't think so. And have you shared your computer screen with anyone recently? Um, no. Okay. No issue, sir. And the. Uh, so what I need to do in order to check your computer, like why you are getting these kind of messages, I have to check your computer. Okay. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to connect your computer. Yeah, I'm going to connect your computer with Microsoft Secure Server. Then we will be able to check that what kind of threats or what kind of you know infections are attacking on your computer. Okay. Then we will be able to fix it. Yeah. So I'm giving you a few troubleshooting steps which you need to follow on your computer. So your computer will get connected to a Microsoft Secure Server. All right. Are you there? Oh, yeah, I'm here. <laughs> okay. So should I give you the troubleshooting steps? Are you ready? Yep, I'm ready. Okay. In the very down below, left hand side corner on your keyboard, can you see there should be a four flags windows icon should be there? Um, yeah, I see that. You need to press and hold that four flag windows key. Okay. And with pressing and holding it, you need to press R, R as in browser. All right. Um, a little run box came up on the bottom left. Yes, that's what we require, sir. So in that box, you can see, is there something written in that box? Um, no, it's completely empty. Great. So in that box, sir, you need to type www. Okay. Fast support. Should I spell it out for you? It's F like Frank. Fast support. Uh, let me spell it out for you, sir. Okay. It's F like Frank. And what is yeah. the message on the Google Chrome? A as an apple. And F like Sam. T like Tango. Support. S as in Sam. U as an umbrella. P as in Peter. Again P like Peter. O as in Oscar. R as in Roger. T like Tango. 
Okay, I can you even inform me, sir? What you do have? I have www.fast support. Yes, then dot com. Okay. And click OK. All right. Okay, uh, it's opened in the Chrome, and uh, the message keeps popping up on top of it. Okay. What you can see now, sir? Yeah, it says go to assist at the top, but I can't click on it. Oh, wait, wait, wait. So are you getting something like which says, like, uh, put your name and support key? Are you getting a box? Yeah, but it's in the, uh, the other tab and um, the pop-ups on top of it, and I can't click on anything. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Got you. No issues, no issues. Let me do that in a different way. Okay. Uh, go ahead and press and hold that four flags in R together once again, or can you uh, can you get that run box once again? Um, okay. All right, I got the run box and it has the um, the support that come in. Okay. So before www, before www, you need to put I as an Indiana. Okay. E as an echo. Oh, okay. X like X ray. Okay. P like Pennsylvania. Okay. L like Lima. All right. O like Oscar. An automatic file transfer to a remote computer has been detected by Windows Firewall. If this transfer was not authorized, R like Roger. Okay. E like Echo. And put a space. Like it's I explore space www.fastsupport.com. All right. And now click on OK. All right. Okay, on it. Explore opened and it says establish support connection. Okay. And it is asking you for your name and uh, support key. Uh, yep. Okay. So put your name there. Okay. Got it. Yeah, meanwhile, I'm generating a support connection for support session for you. Yeah. The code is 551. Should I go ahead? Uh, yep, I got 551. Yeah, then after 199. Five, five, three, one. four, nine. Okay, uh, What's the, the second one? Sure yeah, it, the second one is one nine nine. One nine nine. Three four nine. Three four nine. Mm -hmm. And click on continue. Okay. Okay. So you clicked on continue. Uh, yep, it downloaded something. Oh shit! It downloaded something. 
Oh, great. Can you make a double click on the download or it's saying you to run? Then go ahead and run it. Okay. I'll click on run. Mm -hmm. If it's asking for anything like, uh, do you allow this program to make changes to this computer? Click on yes. Okay. Okay, now what you can see on your computer, sir? Um, it says go to assist, and this is connecting. Oh, fuck. Uh, says, what uh, you can see on, okay, click on yes, sir. It says go yeah, to it assist. It should be asking you that, David Hunter. Yeah, David Hunter asking for, requesting you to join session. Click on yes. Okay. Okay, so your name is also David, am I right? Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, great. It's not a virtual machine, all right? Okay, so I do have the control on your computer right now. As you can see, I'm moving the mouse. Can oh, you see that? Oh, yep, I see that. <laughs> yep. Come on. You can see that, sir? It's remote assistance. Yeah, I see that. By Microsoft. Yeah. And you know what is the concern of this call? That's great. It has been connected. Great. Okay, sure. So as I can see here, this message. And as you can see here, sir, this this message, it's all about your cards, bank, IMG, passwords. Can you see that? Oh, yeah, I see that. The thing is that, sir, the attacker who is attacking on your computer he is just trying to get access on your, not computer, it's, he do have the complete access on your entire internet connection on this one, which is, let me check your network name. Yeah, yeah. everything is, everything is safe. Yeah, so in your, like, it's a home computer, like if this computer is at your home. Uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, so how many more devices, like apart from this computer, how many more devices are getting connected to the same internet connection? Uh -huh. I think this is it, unless my cell phone's connecting to it. Okay. Definitely, sir, if you do have, like, these kind of attackers who do have the complete access on your internet connection, so they can get access to your phone as well. Definitely, they will get it. They will get access to your phone as well. And I would like to ask you, sir, like this Commando Internet Security Premium, it's the free one or you purchased it? Um, I think I purchased it. <laughs> okay. Yeah, it's a premium one. It's written it's not free. Okay, that's great. The thing is that, sir, as you can see on your computer, that it says it's secured. Can you see that? Um, yeah, I see that. Yep. It says it's secured. 
but still you are getting these kind of messages. The thing is that, sir, to be very honest, I would like to explain you that it's not a computer problem at all. Uh, okay. It's not a computer problem at all. The first, yeah, it's a complete hacking attack on your computer. Meanwhile, I'm scanning your computer with the help of this commando internet security. I'm scanning your computer with Microsoft uh, secure scan as well, which is a command window, which will be done by a command window. Okay. So allow me a couple of seconds. You really can't come up with a name better than... Like if there will be anything suspicious, then the scan will get it automatically. Okay. So, so apart from you, who used this computer? Um, it's basically just me. Okay, that's great. And sir, I would like to make sure one more thing that uh, do you believe, like, apart from you, or I like, do you believe you or someone else on this computer? watch some kind of porn videos or adult videos um no okay okay no I issues i don't really use this computer that it's scanning anyway. okay Okay, what you can see on your computer, sir, because right now I can't do anything on your computer. It seems like something is kicking me off from your computer. I see. And how? The, the like, scan and the mouth is, yeah, the mouth is still moving. Huh? Uh, let me close this scan. It seems like this is blocking something. Okay. Can you see here, sir? This scan has been completed and it found clam P in your computer. Can you see that? Oh, uh, yeah, I see that. <laughs> clam P. Have you heard this name before? Clam P. Not really, no. Okay. Allow me a couple of seconds. Let me check what is it. Let me open google.com where we can, you know, search for this, that what is Clampy. Oh, you can read about it, sir. It says Clampy is a man in the browser chosen that can transmit financial and personal data from an infected computer to a third party. Clampy was first observed in 2007 and only affect computer running Microsoft Windows. Can you see that, sir? I see that. That's what happened, sir. So, do you do internet banking on your computer, sir? Um, on this computer? Um, not really. Yeah. No, like on your cell phone, on any computer, I would like to make sure. Yeah, I, I do it on my, my phone. That's the thing, sir. Like, see, let me show you this. This is your internet connection. Okay. Okay. <laughs> this is your internet connection, and uh, as you can see, no there are one, two, connection. three, four, five computers are getting connected into it. Okay. But if this thing, if the entire internet connection, this thing is getting hacked, if someone else have the complete access on this particular internet connection. It will infect or it will, he will get access to your, all of the computers. Okay. That's what the thing is, sir. 
it doesn't matter you do, you are using your cell phone you are using your you know computer in order to do credit card or internet banking definitely the person who is who have the complete access on your computer he will get access on your computer for sure Oh, okay. You will get access to your credit card information, your email, your social media like Facebook, and your credit card and your internet banking. So, sir, I would like to make sure that uh, how old your computer is. Uh, um, I'm not really sure because my friend gave this computer to me, and I only had it for like a year or two. Okay. Well, it's an old computer, sir. As I can see, you don't have any warranty on this computer as well. But I'm not asking for any kind of money in order to fix this computer. Okay. We will fix your computer issues for free. And uh, as you can see that, sir, this is not a computer problem. And so the thing is, just because of this hacking attempt, just because of these hacking things, hacking softwares are there in your computer, and that softwares are infecting your computer. So I'm writing it down here, it's INF. INF stands for infections in your computer. And as we can see here, 805 infections are there in your computer, sure. Eight hundred and five infections. And these infections are quite enough to crash down your new computer, sir. And as you can see, that's your remote software. You told me that it's your computer is going, you know, your computer is uh, like transferring files from a, from your computer to a remote computer. As you can see, that's your remote access software in your infections is present. Okay. Yes, sir. So what you need to have, like we have to work on your computer at least for a couple of hours in order to get it fixed. But what you need to have, that is anti-hacking tool, which is important, which is mandatory in a, order to get it fixed. Moreover, you need to have SSL. It's secure. Socket layer. It's a kind of a security layer, which will be, you know, which will be installed on your entire internet connection in order to remove this hacker from your internet connection, sir. So these two things you need to do. You need to purchase that from Microsoft. So please let me know, sir. Uh, do you have like any store nearby you? Um, a Microsoft Store. Microsoft Store. Um, no, yes, sir. Not really. Because if you are going on, st yeah. Because if you are going on Staples and if you are going on Best Buy or Geek Spot, what they people will do, they will fix it up. Like I'm not saying that they are not eligible enough to get it fixed. They will fix it, but yes, they will cost you a bit more money. And they are not going to give you a guarantee. Like they will, if they are fixing it for one time, they will cost you ninety-nine dollars. For one year, they will cost you one forty-nine dollars, and they will just clean up your computer and they will fix your computer problems. And they are asking for one forty-nine dollars in order to fix your computer problems only. But if you are doing it from Microsoft, like we are here to fix your computer problems for free, we are not asking for any kind of money in order to fix your computer. But yes, you need to purchase these two things, which you can get on Microsoft Store. So what I'm going to do, sir, I'm going to open Microsoft Store on your computer itself. You can get it online. That's not a problem. Okay. Um, I have a question. Sure. Ask me, sir. If you do have any questions, ask me. I'm here to help you only. Okay. Um, you talk a lot about um Microsoft and like um like Deep Squad and Best Buy and stuff like that. Um, are you Microsoft yep. or are you a different company? <laughs> I know, sir. You are talking to Microsoft Windows Support Department. Oh. I'm so not a third party. If I would be a third party, then definitely I would say that yes, sir. It will cost you this much money, and I'll fix it. 
Okay. So I'm not uh, a third party server. That's why I'm uh, opening opening. Yeah, that's why I'm opening the store near uh, in front of your computer, and I let you know the benefits of the products, and then you can choose which fits your budget, and you can go with that. Okay, so the, sure, for one time fix for one device. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, so, does your department have a website? Sir, it's Microsoft. You are talking to Microsoft, oh, and okay. you are on Microsoft website itself. Oh, okay. I so, as you can see, that sir, like this one is the ninety-nine dollars and ninety-nine cents, which is a security which will be valid on your computers, like on your internet connection as well. It will be valid for one year which will take care of your all the devices okay okay this windows server 2012 mm -hmm. this one will be valid for a couple of years the security will be valid for a couple of years and you will get a computer support for one year it will cost you 169 dollars 99 cents this is for three years which will cost you 189 dollars and it will be valid for three years and for five years, it will cost you $199.99. And for 10, it's one, $439.99, but it's for enterprises. Like if you do have more than five computers, then it's beneficial. But whatever security I'm recommending you, it will be for your both the devices, like for your cell phone as well, and for your computer as well. And it will be valid for a couple of years. The securities will be valid for securities will be valid for a couple of years, and moreover, you'll get a computer support and a phone support for entire one year. If you do have any issue, like uh, if you're facing some trouble on your printer, on your computer, on your cell phone, you can give us a call, and we will be there for your help. Okay, um, this doesn't. Look like security it says yeah. Windows Server. Yep. But I don't have a server. I'm sorry? Yeah, this it says Windows Server 2012. I don't have a Windows Server. I don't know. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so it's Windows Server like it's a program. In Windows Server in Windows Server this is two things. The anti-hacking tool and the SSL, which is secure socket layer. It's a Windows secure server. Like it's not the name of that product is Windows Server 2012. It's a pack. You can see there it's Windows Server 2012 license pack. So in pack, there are n number of softwares, like n number of things are there. Like it's a cleanup as well. It's an auto cleanup. Like in future, we are we are putting a defender on your computer because your defender service is not working. As I can see, it will repair your defender as well it will activate defender so you don't need to purchase any computer security in future like it will be computer security internet security and all the things like let me show you here what kind of securities are getting crashed in your computer can you see here these are the Microsoft services it's Windows licensing monitoring services running Windows Defender it's not running it has been stopped and you can see this one Windows Defender network inspection service it's also not working. It has been also crashed. As you can see, this one, the software protection, it's also not working. It has been stopped. Um, and this one, Windows Defender Advanced, Advanced Threat Protection Service. Like, you got the message that a potential threat has been found in your computer. As you can see that, sir, Windows Defender Advanced Threat Protection Service, it's not working. It has been crashed. So in this package, which you are going to have, in this package, you will get all those services which are getting stopped. So we need to work on your uh, kind of a couple of hours or three hours in order to repair those services with the help of this software pack. Okay. Once it will be repaired, then you will be able to use your computer. Sure, it's not a normal game. It's uh, somewhere around. It's going to take somewhere around a couple of hours or three in order to fix your computers. Because if we will not fix your computer right now or if you will not secure your network, there are two disadvantages are there, like if you are not getting it fixed. The hacker will still, like the hacker will be still active in your computer. Moreover, the services are getting stopped. 
so definitely might be the infections the computer infections can crash down your computer sir and you will be not able to use your computer you will have to purchase a new computer so i don't want you to be in that particular situation so that's why i'm recommending you this okay um i'm not really sure what the actual issue is because I don't the issue, sir, like I have already told you, yeah, the issue is, sir, only one issue is there, and it's very simple, that your computer, your internet connection has been hacked. The first issue is that, okay? The second issue is that just because of that hacking things, your computer got infected. And it's infected enough that it could be crashed at any point of time. These two things are there only. There are only two issues in your computer and in your network. Okay, but um, you, you said the, uh, the Windows Defender stuff is, is like not working, but I don't, I don't want to use Windows yes, sir. Defender. I want to use Komodo. <laughs> No, 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 not a problem, sir. Not a problem if you want to use Commando. Definitely, you can use it. But only one thing is not getting crashed, sir. As you can see, there are n, num there are n number of services out there. There are n number of services out there which are getting stopped. Can you see that? A oh. lot of things are there. Even, even you don't have a software protection. So if you are putting Commando, after some time, if your commando will also get crashed because Windows will not support your commando. So if your software protection is getting crashed, then the commando will also not work. It will give you, it will give you fake results. It will say you that yes, your computer is secured, but still you will get some issues like the way you are getting right now. Like you got an error message, you got an error message that yes, there are some, you know, uh, potential threats are there or infections are there, but uh, still your commando is saying that your computer is secured. So how it could be possible, sir? That's, that, is the pro that is the problem, sir. Your software will say that, yes, your computer is secured. But okay, so is, is the thing is, your computer is not secured at all. Yes, sir, can you support I'm sorry? Is Komodo in that, that list of like that stuff? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Definitely, sir. The thing is, see, it's infected and it's crashing services on a daily basis. Okay. Uh -huh. Definitely, sir. Yeah, definitely. you can see that, sir, it's getting crashed as on a daily basis. Like daily on a daily basis, few services are getting crashed. I can show you the date and time as well. Yeah, that's fine. So only only Commando is running right now. But as I can show you that some services are getting stopped on a daily basis. So right now Commando is working. Might be after some time. Might be after some time it will crash your Commando as well. Okay. I'm not sure. I don't like. I wish it should be working. I don't have a problem with like um, just stop uh, using this computer and getting rid of it because um, I don't really use this anymore. I'm sorry. I don't have a problem with you know getting rid of this computer because it's kind of old and I don't use it anymore. Sure, you do have Windows 10 computer. Why you are getting like why you are getting rid of it? It's the best computer, sir. It's a good computer. It's a, your computer have a very good configuration. It's working perfectly fine. But yes, it's, it's getting infected. So I'm giving you an assurance and giving you a guarantee that once you get the securities on your computer, I'm giving you a promise that I will wor make your computer working like a brand new computer. Um, okay. Yep. I'll make it like a brand new computer. As per the performance wise, yeah. I can't come at your place and I'll, I can't change the covers. But yes, by performance wise, I'll make it a brand new computer. Are you there? Uh, yeah, I'm still here. I'm just 
you know, I, I could do all this stuff I do on this computer on my phone. So I, I just, I don't really think I need this computer. <laughs> no issue, sir. The thing is, if you even no, don't need this computer, but still, your computer and uh, your entire internet connection has been hacked. Even I also not prefer using computers. I also use my phone in order to do every single thing. But the thing is, if your entire internet is getting hacked, then in that situation, at least you should protect your internet connection. Doesn't matter if you don't want to protect your computer, it's fine. I'll clean it up, I'll fix it for free. I'm not asking for any money in order to fix your computer, sir. Whatever money or like whatever charges you are seeing there, it's not for computer fixation, sir. It's for, you know, the hacking things in order to fix your entire internet connection. Oh, okay. And as you can see, and as you can see the date and time here, sir, it's today only. It's today only. It has crashed somewhere around six services in your computer. It's only today. Oh, so those are services. I don't. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay, I see. Let me go ahead and take it out, sir. And then yes, David. So that's what the thing is. It needs to be done. Okay. Yeah, the best I can do for you, David, like um, you are our customer and definitely you are worried about your security things and uh, still if you don't want to like, so what I can do for you, like uh, I can give you like, I'm not here to provide you like any kind of discount, but yes, I do have a discount coupon. The price is $169, but I can make it one forty nine dollars and ninety nine cents. That will be a one time fee and it will protect your all the devices for a couple of years. Router, modem, phone, printer, yes, sir. and it's going to take somewhere around 90 to 120 minutes in order to get it fixed. So tell me, David, uh, should we go ahead and uh, protect your computer um, okay. and your entire yeah, network? So if you're the Microsoft Windows department, um, do you do like Comcast Internet too? I'm sorry? So do you protect Comcast Internet because that's a, the network? Mm -hmm. No, sir. Um, I'm not the one who can take care of uh, Comcast. I can provide you network security. Like if your internet connection is getting hacked, I can repair it. I can repair it. I can fix it. But I can't put the security, uh, like I can't uh, do anything with the, you know, services. I can't do anything with the, you know, internet services. Oh, okay. I'm not Comcast, sir. I know your, yeah, I know your internet service provider is Comcast, I believe. If your internet service provider is Comcast, that doesn't matter. That's Even if you are going to call Comcast in order to get this problem fixed, that yes, someone else have the complete access on my internet connection, what you guys can do. Definitely they are going to say that, sir, we are providers. We are not security providers. We are here to provide your internet connection. So what they will do, they will also recommend you to go to a third party or to Best Buy or Staples in order to get it fixed. But the best thing is that, that you are talking to a legitimate company, you are talking to Microsoft. So if you are taking any securities from Microsoft, it will be better than a Staples or Best Buy or Geek Squad. Oh, okay. Yeah. Now, before let you go, because it's a 
So should I register you with this plan, sir? Um, uh, I'm not really sure about that, that Windows Server thing still. It, it just seems a little weird. You know, because I, I heard Windows Server and like data centers and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. But I don't mm -hmm. know about home stuff. Hmm. Uh, what do you know about Windows Server? Like you told me that you don't have a server. What do you know about Windows Server? Um, it's it's like a, like a, another operating system, I guess, like Windows Ten or something. <laughs> no sir, no sir, no sir. The Windows Server is your entire internet connection. It's your entire internet connection. It's a server. It's a server where your devices are getting connected. Okay. Um, server is something which is a database. Server is something which is a database in which your devices are getting connected. Your all the database is getting recorded. Like whatever you do on internet, like you are using your credit card, you are using your internet banking, you are using your emails. So there is a database on your internet connection, which is called server, where your all the internet activity is getting recorded. Like your email address, passwords, your email address, your passwords, your internet banking user ID, your password, your credit card number, your expiry date of your credit card, CBC code of your credit card. All the things are getting recorded to a database. And the attacker having the complete access on that particular database itself. So I have a So you do have a server, even if you do have one. Yes, sir, you do have a Windows server. And that, and that particular Windows server has been hacked. Okay, you, you said it was like a program. Now you said it's like a, something where everything's connected and something's on my network. I don't, hmm. I don't, I don't understand anymore. I'm confused. Sir, you are yeah, you are getting you are getting confused in server and the internet connection. Am I right? Yeah. yeah could. On your internet connection, sir, okay. on your internet connection, there is a database. There is a server, a Windows server, okay? I don't, I don't see Where one. you're all the... In <laughs> sir, you can't see. You can't see that. It's not a, you know, you are not, uh, you are at home. You are not in an, in an organization. Even if you are working somewhere, if you are a working professional, you can see in every organization, there is a different IT room. There is an IT room where you can see a number of, you know, devices there in order to keep the internet service working. That is a particular server of that particular organization. So the same thing lies. Yeah, the same thing is happening with home computers as well. If you do have an internet connection, then definitely you do have a server. Because without having a server, you can't use internet access. When you took, when you take internet connection from Comcast, Xfinity, or anyone, or a local service provider, they provide you a Windows server. Or they provide you an internet server in your so internet I connection. Mac, I, if I have it's a, a Mac, part of I it. I still get a Windows server, even if I'm Mac. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You will get a Windows server only, because in Mac as well. If you will go on a spotlight or if you are searching for Microsoft in your Mac as well, there are a lot of things. There are a lot of services in Mac as well which are provided by Microsoft. And do you know, sir, like Apple paid $33,000 or $31,000 to Microsoft in order to get that, you know, server things and the services to put on Apple computers. Uh, I have a hard time If you want, that. you can re Yeah, if you want... <laughs> no, no, if you want, I can show you that, sir. Even an, in an interview, the owner of, the owner of uh, you know, Apple and uh, Bill Gates and uh, the owner of Apple, they said they... He accepted that, yes, he paid $31,000. If you would like to see the interview, I can show you that too. Well, that's like, like one second. 30 years ago or something like that. How much? 
Yes. Yes, sure. How much Apple paid to Microsoft? Come on. Apple, Microsoft invest for Apple. If Apple didn't hold overseas, it would be. You can read all the information about it, sir. I believe it was a 997. Yes, go ahead. You can see that, sure. A lot of things happen, sir. So even if you're if you do have a Mac, you do have Microsoft services in that. Okay. So now tell me, David. What should we do now? I believe I was eligible enough to provide you all the answers which you asked. Okay, um, I guess we can just uh, get the uh, Windows Server thing, I guess. Good choice, good choice. So let me open a registration page in front of you. Okay. So how would you like to make the payment? Like uh, you would like to give us a credit card, debit card, or a check. Um, I have. We a, do have like all the options. We accept. I have a credit card. Okay. Do you have a debit card or something? Um. Uh, no, just a, a credit card. No, just a credit card. Okay. 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 Okay, allow me a couple of seconds. Okay. Let me open a secure payment <laughs> portal in front of you. Allow me a couple of seconds here. All right, sure. hurry the fuck up, bitch. Goddamn. Stupid as fuck. <sighs> and your cell phone is on. Um, what was that? I would like to ask you that your cell phone is on, like it should be on. Uh, your computer should be on in order to. Yeah, it's on. Okay, allow me a couple of seconds. Sure, ask some stupid ass questions. Uh, so Answer, so I would like to tell you this is a reseller, like the Microsoft reseller, that is the iKarma One Support. And this is the payment link which I'm providing. It's a registration link here, which is going to be in front of your computer right now. And on your credit card statement, you'll get a name that will be. Right Tech LLC. This is the. You can see that, sir. The amount is $149. On your credit card statement, you will get a name that it's going to Right Tech LLC. Right Tech LLC is the payment merchant, their payment service provider of us. Okay. Um, what, what was the name again? Right Tech LLC. Okay. Uh, and sir, this is the registration. Yeah, this is the registration. I'll I'll write it down. Oh, okay. I'll write it down on your notepad. Okay. You'll get a yeah. You'll get a contract copy. So, all the things will be mentioned there. All right. Yeah. So I should fill this out. So here we go. This is the registration. Yeah, please. Okay. 
We just need to put a slash. Uh, okay. Just remove the slash here. It's like uh, it's twenty one nine. Um. Yep. Okay. Okay, put your billing address there. He's copying information. You can hear him typing. Okay, wait for a moment, sir. Allow me a couple of seconds. What happened? Wait for a moment, sir. Oh, there we go. We made a mistake here. Sir, uh, what is the expiration date? Um, it's 09 slash 21. That was the mistake there. Okay, no issues. Allow me a couple of seconds. Oops, I'm sorry. Sir, it's there is something wrong here. It's nine zero nine twenty one. Am I right? Yep. Uh, uh, the expiration date. Mm -hmm. So, like, it's two thousand twenty one. Or it's like how? Yeah, it says 09 slash 21. That's what it says on the card. Okay. And is it a MasterCard? Um, yeah. yeah. Answer, like, which. Like, uh, is it a Chase card? Like, it's a Chase bank. Um, uh, yeah, but it's a it's a master card. Okay, wait, wait for a moment. Thank you for staying connected to Fred Henry and for the letter side team. How are you doing today? We will try it one more time. He really wants that credit card. Do you have? Funds available in your bank account, like in your checks, uh, in your card, sir? Uh, of course not. Do you not. have 149 in your card? Um, uh, I should. It should be, yeah. Okay. 
you an email. That's the reason you'll call this transfer here. Okay. Try it once again, yes, sir. I will let you know about it. Uh, not that okay. much easy because as this is a fake email that you have received from uh, over your email and you keep telling you that if you have received this email from the brother, what I have to do here is I have to take some so, of the things onto your network. It seems really yeah, Sir, yeah, you don't want to pay that? Somebody else is sending some mm -hmm. Because um, I, I have strong like you need to put your. I I just feel like this is one of those Microsoft scams. So you don't want to pay this? Tell me yes or no. I I'm not sure if I want to pay like a scam or I don't get anything out of it. You know. Yes, there will be some charges for that. Yeah. Sir, what you are purchasing? You are purchasing it from Microsoft. Then how you can? Make sure that yes, you are talking to a scammer. Well, Whatever the, plan you are purchasing, that those, Whatever uh, plan events, you are purchasing, event view or like crashed services when oh. they're not. Yes. Sure. And you told me those services Definitely, were sir. Your computer is about hackers when they're supposed to be stopped. You know that they're supposed to be stopped. Yes, definitely. If you're if the attackings are going on on your computer, so definitely the services will be a stop. So tell me, sir, like you are like aware, right now you are aware that what's going on in your computer. Well, I, I'm not. Whatever sure. going on in your computer, sir, you are. You know, I'm not. You know, completely stupid. So what should I do now, sir? Well, I, I just want some answers. Sir, like, then if you are not, you, you type in a. The dirt command in the, the, C, the command. Sir, I explained you all the you things. In, sir. You typed in the message at the bottom, and you uh -huh. told me that was in my computer when it's not. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. So why I'll do that, sir? Why I'll do that, sir? You, it's your computer generated message, sir. Why? Why? why I'll do that, sir. Message. You copy and paste it in. And there. whatever. No, not at all, sir. Your computer was generating these messages. I was not doing it. And so if you do had, like, if you were not, like, in, like, uh, at past, which, when you were not, uh, you know, confident enough that, yes, you were talking to a Microsoft, then why you agreed that, yes, I'll go with it or whatever? So if you were not confident, then please don't waste our time, sir. Well, you, you told me uh, those, uh, as simple as that. It, you're scamming. Sir, I, I answered your every question. Yeah, but you can so fake I answered your like all the queries. Windows Server 2012 is a So if you are no 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 wait 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 badass hardware. Wait okay. wait for a second, sir. How how you can say that I gave you fake answers and if you are educated enough to know everything about the computer problems, then why you are not fixing it? How sir? does fuck does someone with a Mac have a Windows server if the only thing is it a Mac? to their network. Wait, 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 wait for a moment. Wait for a moment, These are sir. Questions I now, if you want, I have wasted. I have no, no. I have wasted. I have wasted my time. No issues. I'm gonna waste one more hour. Just one, just one thing. I need to prove that yes. What kind of services are there in Mac? Wait. Give me a couple of seconds, sir. Let me show you. I'm not here. I'm not here opening an institute, sir. I'm here a technician. If you know You're everything economy, about the computers, then fix it by your own. Well, I don't need sir, to fix if you know everything about computers, computer. get it fixed. You know, that website. Then why, the, then why you call this? Because I have Then why to you call this today? Because I Can I have the reason? That pop-up told me to call you, and I thought that was real, but it's not. No, 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 no. In a Bill no, Gates no, 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 no. How shit, you can... That's not even... Relevant. That's not relevant. No, 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 no. I'm just going to show you that what kind of services are there in a Mac. You can uh, do one thing, sir. I'm just opening how, this, how does it and you can see, and you can. No, 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 no. If you don't have to trust me, then why you call me, sir? Because that that's what my question to. is. <laughs> Then I told you what needs to be done. I told you what needs to be done. You were agreed to pay one forty-nine dollars and ninety-nine cents. Well, and right now, you are, you are, you are no, no, you are not trying to make the payment intentionally. 
So I will not get script. the money or you will not pay okay. anything. No, no, I was script. not reading any scripture. I scanned your computer. I was scanning you your computer scan and it. then we got that you error. Just typed in a command, a, a, a tree I command. scanned it, sir. No, not at all. No, not at all, sir. No, it's a, not a tree command. And what, what do you know about the tree command, sir? Well, it's uh, it just looks cool, okay? Wait, wait for a moment. What is this? Yeah. Do tree, yeah? What you can do now with the help of tree? Can you write down something? Oh, uh, yeah. Can you write something? Yeah, try to write it. Yeah, it's at the bottom. Don't worry, it'll, it'll, be, it'll be done soon. Yeah, how? It's not getting stopped. Let's keep going on. Oh, uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's just, okay, it's, it's going to be done soon, okay? Okay, I'm waiting. Okay. Yes, I'm also waiting. You did the same shit. I'm trying to right? see. I'm trying to see that. Yeah, I'm also trying to see that what kind of, you know, education you are going to provide me in order to see that, uh, in order to check that, yes, what kind of problems are there in the computer. Meanwhile, can I do something? Uh, Meanwhile, your computer, like, as per you, the computer uh, is scanning. What, are you going to put a syscall? Can I do something else? What, what do you want to do? Why I'll do that, sir? Why I'll do that? Uh, yeah, cause I, Why I, I'll I, do that, sir? I know you would. <laughs> I don't have that much time to do those shitty things, sir. Well, do one thing, I'm going out of your computer, okay? No, 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 no. Wait, wait, wait. wait. I'm, going, I'm going out of your computer. No, I, I want you to see this shit. I'm going out of your computer. Get your... You're going to sit here and watch this, okay? Obviously, you broke it. Oh, there we go. It's still working. And now you're still there. Yeah, he's still there. Oh, the, the secure Microsoft, the bullshit scam is almost done, okay? I know you're still there. Look at that. Look at all this. Look at that. There's Coop Face. There's a. This Kimpy or whatever the fuck you said. Oh, yep. Yeah, here we go. It's it's pretty much done by now. Yeah, it's done. Look at this shit. Oh my god. Look at all those hackers. Look at all those hackers flying across the screen. Holy shit. They just stole all your information. You're still there. And I'll charge you $399.99,000 million to fix it. Oh, look at these issues. These are all of those hackers. Initiated by you. This may be an attempt of data theft. Please call Windows Technical Support immediately to diagnose your PCs. Hackers. Oh my god, hackers. Look at that shit. Look at that. Would you just look at it? Just just look at it, okay? Just look at it. Pick up your fucking phone, okay? And you better listen to me. I'm your father. I know you're still there because there's still shit happening back. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Scammer inside. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> You're still there. Oh, yeah. You're still there. I knew it was still there. Oh, fuck. <laughs> it just hung up. It's still there. 
Yeah, it's still there. He deserves this. This is just for him. He responded. Look at this idiot. 